local weather authority forecast. It's a seasonably cool start across the basin. This is a live look at the tall city early on your Tuesday morning. Still dark out there. We still have that night vision on, but we do notice that the city lights are highlighting some passing clouds. These clouds not producing any rain for now for most areas, but that may change later today. But before then, the warmest air of 2023 will eventually be underway. Take a look at the satellite and radar. We do notice that we have a lot of clouds, a lot of moisture well off to our west. Places like El Paso, stream of moisture, clouds and rain moving off through. Likely not affecting us in the basin for the first half of today, but we do notice the progression is eastward. And that's eventually going to be spelling in a weather pattern change. And before then, winds will really pick up. A high wind warning in effect till... Thursday, 12 a.m. Central Time, 11 p.m. Mountain Time, Wednesday. For Pine Springs, you guys are included for winds likely more to gust above 60 to 70 to even 80 miles per hour. That's something that we may not see quite today, but eventually we'll see as we head in the day tomorrow. We do notice again more clouds and rain. Mostly north and west of our viewing area. Some of that in Carlsbad and Hobbs not really amounted to too much. A lot of these lighter greens indicate light rainfall. The farther south and east you go in the basin, the clearer the skies are. And because of lighter winds and a lot of dry air in the atmosphere, temperatures a little bit lower compared to yesterday morning in the higher 40s, low to mid 50s in the Midland and Odessa area. Actually sitting closer to 40, not 45 in Marfa right now. So initial conditions on this model slightly off. But I think this model will do uh, Pretty good job of depicting these well above normal temperatures this afternoon. 70s and 80s in the Midland and Odessa area. Mid to upper 80s in the southern and eastern basin. Higher 60s and 70s in the higher elevations. The first day of 2023 that will likely reach the 80 degree mark and the warmest thus far. 80 degrees already at 3 p.m. despite a lot of clouds. I think it will be rain free. A little bit more humid than yesterday and a little bit less breezy out there. We do notice the progression of the clouds and rain showers are trying to move eastward in western areas later today. Eventually, we'll move eastward later this evening with greens and even some brighter yellows indicate briefly some moderate rainfall. So rain showers overnight, low temperatures in the 50s with winds start to switch a little bit more from the south and west at 10 to 20 miles per hour. They'll eventually switch more from the west in earnest later tomorrow with drier air. Not only do we have to watch out for blowing dust, but fire weather. Fire weather watch in effect till 8 p.m. Central Time for much of the basin. That's in effect till Wednesday. And high wind watch in effect till 12 a.m. Central Time for Carlsbad, Hobbs, Pecos down near the Rio Grande. 70s and 80s today. Tomorrow, 60s and 70s with blowing dust and limited visibility likely. So make sure you guys are weather aware. Pretty warm today, less breezy. Cooler tomorrow, more sunshine, but more windy. A little bit cooler Thursday and Friday, but eventually warming up later this weekend. And